Hey guys, Marty here, and there's a couple of things going on in the shop today. I have to make a longboard, and so I thought I would document that process, and it might be something good to put out here. Um, a lot of people have questions. A few years ago, I started a little longboard business, making longboards for the local kids here in town, and, and uh, I've got quite a few boards out there in the wild, and and it's it's a fun process i enjoy making them it's a lot of fun i get to be creative because i do custom artwork on them and so i get to kind of do a lot of things uh which makes it fun and i just glued up some boards um, just one deck is what i'm working on today so i kind of walked through the process um, i didn't have any skateboard wood so i went to my local menards and they have baltic birch how many ply one two three four five ply Baltic birch quarter inch plywood and if you glue two of those up you get a half inch and that's enough to make a deck it's pretty sturdy um, it's got enough it's really got 10 plies most skateboards are between seven and nine um, so it's it's quite a hefty board um, it's still flexible enough that you can get some convex into the deck so here's what I've got um, got a little bit of convex to it um, this is just a plain 12 inches wide, 48 inches long, and then we're going to cut it down to look like this. So, um, we'll walk you through the process. Uh, we'll go through the whole thing. Cutting it, shaping it. Um, we'll paint them up, install the trucks and wheels and bearings and all those things that happen when putting a longboard together. So, uh, my board company is called Two Lines Board Company. Um, two lines because um, both of my daughter's names end in L-I-N-E, Madeline and Caroline. So I have two lines, and that's where the name comes from. Uh, but this, this board we're making because um, Young Life has a banquet, um, a fundraising banquet, and my wife is one of the board members for Young Life here locally in Chillicothe. And I, she wants to donate a board um, for a silent auction. So that's what we're doing. Now we have our rough shape. And now we'll take it to the sander and really clean it up and get the shape right. So shaping a board, it's shaped, rough shape. Um, we'll do some fine tuning, we'll route the edges, um, but it's starting to look like a skateboard. It's starting to take shape. So I am sort of made shift a router table um, to route the edges. So uh, it clamps onto my jaw horse and uh, I've used it for a couple years now and it works great. It doesn't take up a lot of space because I can lean it up against the wall when I'm not using it. Keep my router mounted to it and I just clamp it in there and go. So it works out really well. Edges look good, shape looks good, got a little bit of a convex so your feet should lock in on it. Um, yeah, 
deck looks good. I like it. We're ready to move on. Uh, now it's ready to paint, but I'm thinking I might just stain it. Leftover cutting from the uh, from the, the grip tape, and you use it on the edges to kind of sand the edges down smooth, and it'll keep the edges from peeling up. Okay, so I finished up the longboard um, all in one day. Here's the bottom graphics, big lightning bolt. Just thought it looked fast in the black, so um, it's kind of the, the direction I went with the decor. It'll, it'll ride nice, it'll glide over bumps. Um, it'll be a fun board to ride. So I really like the front graphic um, with the logo. I just think it turned out really nice. It was a fun project. It was fun to kind of knock it out in a hurry. Hopefully uh, whoever buys this at the silent auction will enjoy writing or have a kid that enjoys writing. Um, I look forward to that. If you liked what I made today, if you enjoyed um, the process of making a longboard, if you ever have any questions, you know, comment below. I'll be happy to answer any question you might have. If you like this channel, and like to see me take on some challenges and uh, learn new things, uh, hit the subscribe button um, down below. In the comments, if there's something you would like to see me do, uh, see me make, something you want me to try, leave a comment and uh, we'll see if it makes the list. So enjoy, ride safe.